everyone, I'm Roshni Raghu. In this experiment, I'm going to demonstrate the process of crystallization in alum. Crystallization is a process by which a solid forms, where the atoms or molecules are highly organized in a regular pattern to form a structure known as a crystal. We'll observe the same in the case of alum. The materials required are 200 ml of boiled water, a food color of your choice, 90 gram of powdered alum, a popsicle to stir, and a folded pipe cleaner attached to the cardboard which will act as the base for the crystal and later as the seed. So let's get started. First I'll add the powdered alum to the boiled water. I'll stir it in order to form a supersaturated solution. Supersaturated solution is a solution which contains the solute more than it can even dissolve. As the solute is more, it makes the solution unstable and hence helps in crystallization. Our supersaturated solution is ready. Now, I'm going to add the food color. I'm going to stir it. Now, I'm going to suspend the base structure comprising the folded pipe cleaner supported by the cardboard into the supersaturated solution. I'll keep my setup unperturbed for 12 hours. After 12 hours, I observe that the seed crystal is formed. crystal is a substance that provides a nucleation site so that the excess dissolved crystals can grow on it. So now I am going to heat my supersaturated solution excluding the seed crystal to get our desired result. For boiling, I will keep the glass tumbler inside the vessel that is much bigger than it and it contains water. Then I will heat it. While it continues to heat, I'll add 30 gram of powdered alum to it and stir it well. allow the supersaturated solution to cool down by coming to the room temperature. As the supersaturated solution has now cooled down, I will put back the seed crystal into the solution. And I will keep the setup unperturbed for 12 hours. After 12 hours, I observe that we have obtained our desired result of the alum crystal. Alum or potassium aluminium sulfate is a chemical compound with the formula EAlSO4 into 12H2O. It forms beautiful regular octahedral crystals like the one we obtained. Formation of alum crystals is crystallization. In my experiment, crystallization occurred at room temperature. When alum was supersaturated in water, 
crystallization is the first phase occurs, allowing the molecules of alum to stick together to form one large seed crystal. Further, rest of the supersaturated solution was heated and alum was added to it to grow the crystals using the seed crystal. The crystals nucleated to the seed crystal because crystallization for the second phase occurred. Therefore, we obtained a beautiful regular octahedral alum crystal. Thank you.